most people talk about find the pain point and then give them the yep. story, then give them that. So you really are talking about find that need before you're spilling with unneeded information. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, a lot of people, when you start talking about what's bothering your prospects, what are their problems, they, they get a little resistant. They don't want to be labeled as manipulative as pressing the pain button. But here's the thing. If we're going to meet prospects where they are, if we're really going to empathize with them, which is critical, we have to understand what they're feeling. And oftentimes they're feeling frustrated or often they are stuck, but you can't just do all of that, you know, needle them and the problems and agitate the problems without on the other side, revealing and envisioning the solution. If, if all you do is focus on all of the bad outcomes that come, that can come, well, that is fear-based marketing, and that does get to be a little bit manipulative. But if you can combine the empathy where they are with the envisioning, and then you can show them how your product and service enables that journey to occur, now you've got a powerful story or series of stories that you can tell over and over and over again.